Honourable Senators, I have received a proclamation summoning the Parliament in the following terms. I, General the Honourable David Hurley, AC, DSC, retired, Governor-General of the Commonwealth of Australia, acting under Section 5 of the Constitution of the Commonwealth of Australia, appoint Tuesday, 26 July 2022, at 10.30am, as the day and time for the Parliament to meet at Parliament House to hold a session of the Parliament. And I summon all senators and members of the House of Representatives to meet at that day, time and place. Signed and sealed with the Great Seal of Australia on 20 June 2022, David Hurley, Governor-General, countersigned by His Excellency's Command, Anthony Albanese, Prime Minister. Honourable Senators, the Deputy of His Excellency, the Governor-General and the Honourable Justice Gagler. Honourable Senators, please take your places. Black Rod, please let the members of the House of Representatives know that I desire their attendance in the Senate.
Senators, members of the House of Representatives, His Excellency the Governor-General has appointed me as his deputy to declare open the Parliament of the Commonwealth. The Clerk of the Senate will now read the instrument of appointment. Appointment of a deputy to the Governor-General to declare open the Parliament. I, General the Honourable David Hurley, AC, DSC, retired, Governor-General of the Commonwealth of Australia, acting under section 126 of the Constitution of the Commonwealth of Australia and Clause 4 of the Letters Patent, dated 21 August 2008, relating to the Office of Governor-General, appoint the Honourable Susan Mary Kiefel, AC, Chief Justice of the High Court of Australia, to be my deputy to declare open the Parliament of the Commonwealth at the time and place appointed by the proclamation published in the Commonwealth of Australia Gazette on 21 June 2022. Dated 7 July 2022, David Hurley, Governor-General. Countersigned by His Excellency's Command, Anthony Albanese, Prime Minister. Pursuant to the instrument which the clerk has now read, I declare open the 47th Parliament of the Commonwealth. His Excellency the Governor-General has commanded me to let you know that after the Senators and members of the House of Representatives have been sworn, the Governor-General will declare in person at this place the cause of his calling the Parliament together. Before that time, it is necessary for the Senate to choose its President and for the House of Representatives to choose its Speaker. Later today, you will present those you have chosen to the Governor-General. The Honourable Justice Gagela will now attend in the House of Representatives to administer the oath or affirmation of allegiance to honourable members of that House. Honourable Senators, His Excellency the Governor-General has authorised me to administer the oath or affirmation of allegiance to Senators elected on 21 May 2022, as required by Section 42 of the Constitution. I call the Clerk to read the Commission. Authority to administer the oath or affirmation of allegiance to Senators. I, General the Honourable David Hurley, AC, DSC, retired, Governor-General of the Commonwealth of Australia, 
acting under section 42 of the Constitution of the Commonwealth of Australia, authorise the Honourable Susan Mary Kiefel, AC, Chief Justice of the High Court of Australia, to administer the oath or affirmation of allegiance to senators. Dated 20 June 2022, David Hurley, Governor General. Countersigned by His Excellency's Command, Anthony Albanese, Prime Minister. I call the clerk to table the certificates of election. I table the certificates of election of senators elected on 21 May 2022. I inform the Senate that Senators Stirl and Thorpe, who are named as elected on the certificates of election, are unavoidably absent from the Senate today and will be sworn in on a subsequent day. Will honourable senators please come to the table as their names are called to make and subscribe the oath or affirmation of allegiance? Will the following senators representing New South Wales please come to the table? Maurice Payne. Yeah. Deborah O'Neill. Yeah. Ross Cadell. Yeah. Jenny McAllister. Yeah. David Shoebridge. Yeah. Andrew Molan. Will those senators making oaths please take your Bible in your right hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. Senators, please sign the test roll and the senators' roll. I return to your places. Will the following senators representing Queensland please come to the table? James McGrath, yeah. Murray Watt, yeah. Matthew Canavan, yeah. Penny Allman Payne, yeah. Pauline Hanson, yeah. Anthony Chisholm. Those senators making oaths. Would you like to get your Bible, Senator? Will those senators making oaths please take your Bible in your right hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. I, James McGrath, do swear that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to Her Majesty the Queen Elizabeth II and her heirs and successors according to law. So help me God. Senators, please sign the test roll and the senators' roll.
Which one's mine? Right Down here? Yeah. Senators. Will the following senators representing South Australia please come to the table? Simon Birmingham, yeah. Penny Wong, yeah. Andrew McLaughlin, yeah. Don Farrell, yeah. Barbara Pocock, yeah. Karen Little. Yeah. <clears throat> Will those senators making oaths please take your Bible in an available hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. I, Penny Solomon, do swear that I will be faithful and true allegiance to the Queen Elizabeth II, and the heirs and successors according to law. So help me God. Senators, please sign the test roll and the senators' roll. Senators representing Tasmania, please come to the table. John O'Dunian, yeah. Anne Urquhart, yeah. Peter Wish Wilson, yeah. Helen Polly, yeah. Wendy Askew, yeah. Tammy Tyrrell. Will those senators making oaths please take your Bible in your right hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. I, I do swear that I will be faithful and true allegiance to the Queen Elizabeth II, the heirs and successors according to law. So help me God. So help me God. Senators, please sign the test roll and the senators roll.
just small oversight time. Thank you, Senators. Will the following Senators representing Victoria please come to the table? Sarah Henderson, yeah. Linda White, yeah. Bridget McKenzie, yeah. Jana Stewart, yeah. Ralph Babette. Will those senators making oaths please take the Bible in your right hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. I, Sarah Henderson, do swear that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, her heirs and successors according to law. So help me God. Senators, please sign the test roll and the senators roll. Yeah. Sign somebody else's. <laughs> Just you? There you go. I can read my name. That's a good start. Yes. Thank you, Senators. Will the following Senators representing Western Australia please come to the table? Sue Lyons, Michaelia Cash, yeah. Dean Smith, yeah. Dorinda Cox, yeah. Fatima Payman. Will those Senators making oaths please take your Bible or Quran in your right hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. I, I Sue Lyons, do swear, swear and affirm and declare that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, her heirs and successors and successors of her and to law, so help me God. Senators, please sign the test roll and the senators roll. I know, it's the same two lefties. The only part of me that's pending. Thank you, Senators. Will the following Senators please come to the table? Representing the Australian Capital Territory, Katie Gallagher, David Pocock, 
representing the Northern Territory, Malindiri McCarthy, Jacinta Nampet, Jimpa Price. Nearly got it. Nearly got it. Will those senators making oaths please take the Bible in your right hand? Senators, please recite the oath or affirmation of allegiance now. I, Sign the test roll and the senator's roll. <laughs> 